Hello, myself Dr. Moitri and I welcome you to today's episode. But before that, I would like to thank you all for subscribing to my channel. And if you haven't already, then please to subscribe and hit the bell notification button to never miss any updates from me. So, Durga Puja is all around. While all other communities practice fasting rituals and limit the amount of food intake, we Bengalis being food lover, we love to have our favorite dishes this time. Be it biryani or luchi alu dom and rasagulla. And why not? This is the biggest festival of ours. We wait the whole year long and we should be happy this time. And happiness is equal to food for us. So this time we have to stay indoors and we might be a little bit more hungry. So I am not going to stop you from having any of your favorite dishes this time. Oh, you might be wondering, then what about all the diet plans and strict routines which we have been following for so long to maintain our weight or lose weight? So will all the things go in vain if we involve in this kind of emotional eating pattern? Then my friend, my answer is no. Please stick to the end of this video and you will get to know some amazing things which if you follow, you are not only going to lose your weight but you will remain fit and you will enjoy all the lovely food you want to have in this Durga Pujo. So let's just get started and wait. I would like to have some small gift from you this Durga Puja and that is 2000 likes in this video. So just hit the like button and please give me my Puja gift this time. Whatever food you want to have during this Puja, write it on a piece of paper and have them all. But not on the same day. Like if you want to have biryani, pizza, ice cream, have them but on different days. By this, you are maintaining certain amount of calorie intake and it is all about the calorie gain. Even if you are eating junk and maintaining the right amount of calorie which your body needs to lose or maintain weight, then you are definitely not going to gain weight. And if you want to see something in details and signs behind the calorie deficit, then do not forget to check on the i button, I will link the video there. And yes, by this I do not give you the license to have junk every day and still maintain your calorie deficit. No, junk food have no nutrients or minerals which are needed for body. But yes, during festivals you can enjoy them. It would be appreciated if your junk or favorite food is home cooked. Then that will be on the healthier side. But if it is at all not possible, then don't worry. Have them on or before sunset so that whatever you're eating is getting digested and is not getting stored as extra fat which can make you overweight. I would like to request you all to follow the Pushpanjali ritual this Durga Puja. You all might know that uh, before offering Pushpanjali or prayers to Ma Durga, you have to fast for some hours in the early morning. And if you have your dinner maximum by 8 pm the previous night and in the morning you are fasting for some hours, then unknowingly you are entering into an intermittent fasting stage. And by that, you are losing your weight. And if you don't know what is intermittent fasting, you want to know the actual science behind that, then I have made two detailed video on that and that will be linked above in the i button. Go and check it. Have pre-junk meals before actually enjoying your junk. You can have a whole egg or any fruit of your choice or handful of nuts. And by this, you are making your stomach full from prior and by that, you will not overeat your junk. And junk are what? Bad calories which can make you overweight and you are limiting that. So isn't it a great idea of enjoying your junk and that too in such a way so that it is not making you overweight or affecting your health and still you are happy that you had it. Although you might hate this point but I would put some extra stress on this. Exercise more. If you are taking some more calories in order to burn them you have to exercise more. Although it does not have any scientific justification that whatever you are eating you can burn them through your exercises. It is rather impossible. But still if you put some extra effort on exercise and dedicate some extra time on exercising that would 
likely to burn some more calories which you are intaking what is the harm you are burning your calories right and some of you who are actually concerned about your good health they will definitely follow this so by this we came to the end of this video i hope you liked it and you will follow these things so that you can enjoy your durga pujo with your favorite food and still you don't have to worry about your weight gain so share this with your friends even and do not forget to hit the subscribe and the bell notification button so that whenever i am uploading a video it comes to your mobile notification at the first and i wish you all a happy durga pujo with good health happiness and all prosperity we will meet soon in our next video till then take care bye and you might see some videos here popping on your screen do check them even